What is presentation skills? When we talk about this, uh, presentation is basically about uh, talking about a product, service or a plan, be it business or social, with a very clear objective and in a very well organized fashion. That's what in the presentation is. Uh, there are many things which can make a presentation very effective, impressive and persuasive. In this video, I am going to talk to you about only two things which will make presentation very very effective. Number one, enthusiasm and number two, I am going to tell you after some time. Uh, what is enthusiasm and how it makes a difference in presentation? Let's take the ideal case of uh, Swami Vivekananda in 1893, Chicago World Religion Summit. When he starts his speech and tells, dear sisters and brothers of America, that's a speech, that's a presentation of the religion, everybody gets up and applauds him. The magic is not in the words alone. Please try to understand, friends. The magic is in the life force of the person who speaks. The enthusiasm, the energy, the trust in the words. And that's why everybody is moved by those words. Please, friends, when Martin Luther King gives his, you know, Tremendous speech that let the freedom ring from the mountains. That's not just the words, the selection of beautiful words, but it's the life in those words that he puts in. Please understand in today's time when Amitabh Bachchan hosts Korn Braya Karoputi, let's play Korn Braya Karoputi, Dviti or Triti or whatsoever. The energy with which he speaks attracts people. Energy, enthusiasm is quite contagious. Anybody who's listening to you, will be caught by that and once you have got your listeners your audience enthusiastic about what you are talking you are successful you have started the journey you know with the right step be it uh, Salman Khan be it Shah Rukh Khan presenting different TV shows or be it any anchor of any program who are into presentation business you talk about any great CEO talking about a business product they, they all are enthusiastic about it you cannot become successful if you are less enthusiastic than 100%. If you want to be successful as a presenter, be minimum 100% enthusiastic. Minimum 100%, I mean it. And the second element which I was talking about, which I wanted to talk about is, make it interesting. There are many ways you can make it interesting. One way which I can just talk about now is by making people curious. Please understand this, human mind is governed more by questions. We always want the answers for the questions. So you will have to create that itching sensation in people of those questions, those curiosity. Please understand, all serials, all suspense thriller and many movies or different scenes of the movies run on this fact that you want to get an answer. Please understand it. A hero chasing a villain in the movie is an ideal case of this. Hero is chasing the villain on the steps, on the staircase and he is not able to catch. Then he crosses the road and he is not able to catch. And somehow he is running, running, running and then... Basically you know, hero is a hero. Hero can catch the villain any point of time. He can jump 300 meters at one time, right? He can fly in the air. So why is he chasing the villain? You know friends, hero is not chasing the villain. In fact the director wants people the people who are watching the movie to chase the villain and once it is done and then finally the hero catches we feel satisfied what this is called making people involved making people curious uh, one common way which you can use to do this is you know asking questions from people about the common facts which they know and which they don't know for example in my presentations whenever i'm talking about certain things like this I asked the, you know, them the ideal question like uh, how many children Adolf Hitler had? Two or three? Was he married? Okay. Now some of them, some of you must be knowing this. Now Adolf Hitler was married 24 hours before his death to his 14 years old, you know, 14 years long relationship with Miss Eva Braun. And then both of them committed suicide. Eva Braun, E-V-A-B-R-A-W-N. Let's take a so this lot of people take a note of this or people feel oh I was not knowing this So this makes them involved in your presentation uh, For example when somebody was talking about the products how it is made he spoke about Taj Mahal Taj Mahal who built Taj Mahal? We all know Shah, Rukh, uh, Shah Jahan Sorry Shah Jahan 
and uh, in whose memory? It was in Mumtaj Mahal's memory. What was her original name? And just give this small pause. This makes people curious to know. Don't please vomit the answer immediately. Number one. Number two. Don't nag people. Don't torture people by creating a long pause. Because when you create a long pause, people don't know the answer. They feel very, you know, am I stupid? And if they feel this, they don't like you. So you, after some pause, you just give them answer. It was in the her original name was Arjumand Banu Begum. Now people are there in you. Please remember, whenever you give them some information, people feel that they are having some take home from this presentation. And whenever somebody goes back from presentation and shares something, shares a part of your talk with your family members or with your friends or anybody, your presentation is successful. You got their interest. You got a repetition of your presentation. So this, these two things, there are many things which make a presentation uh, there are many spices, there are many ingredients which make a presentation uh, successful, effective, interesting. Yes, if you want to know more about them, you please visit our website or contact us on www.c2btrading.com. And I really thank you for spending a good amount of your time from life in listening to me. I hope it will create a wonderful journey ahead life and make all of us successful with the prayers and respect for you thank you very much